Get ready, stargazers. January 2025 is shaping up to be a memorable one. Why? Because the whisperings of the wind tell tales of a polar vortex on the move. This swirling mass of frigid air, usually content to spin above the Arctic, has its sights set on lower latitudes. This isn't unusual, mind you. The polar vortex is a bit like a celestial wanderer, occasionally dipping south to remind us of its chilling power. But this year, the signs point to a particularly potent southward surge. So what's driving this polar plunge? It's a question that has fascinated meteorologists and weather enthusiasts alike. The answer lies in the intricate and dynamic interplay of atmospheric forces that govern our weather patterns. It's all about the delicate balance of atmospheric pressure. Imagine the atmosphere as a vast, invisible ocean of air, constantly shifting and changing. High pressure systems, which are areas where the air is denser and heavier, tend to bring clear, calm weather. On the other hand, low pressure systems where the air is lighter and rises are often associated with clouds, wind, and precipitation. Think of it like a cosmic dance between high pressure zones, bringing clear skies and low pressure systems often associated with storms. This dance is not random but follows the laws of physics and thermodynamics, creating a complex and ever-changing tapestry of weather patterns. Over North America a powerful high pressure system is expected to build, pushing eastward. This system acts like a giant atmospheric bulldozer, clearing the skies and creating a stable weather pattern. However, this stability comes at a cost. This, in turn, weakens the jet stream, a band of fast-moving air that usually acts as a barrier, keeping the polar vortex in check. The jet stream is like a river of air high above the Earth, guiding weather systems and influencing temperatures. When it weakens, it loses its ability to contain the polar vortex. With the jet stream weakened, the vortex is free to meander southward, bringing its icy breath to our doorstep. The polar vortex, a large area of low pressure and cold air surrounding the Earth's poles, can dip far enough south to affect weather in the mid-latitudes. This results in sudden and severe cold snaps, transforming landscapes into winter wonderlands and challenging our resilience against the cold. Now let's talk about the star of the show, the polar vortex. It's not a single storm but rather a large area of low pressure and cold air surrounding both of Earth's poles. It's always there but weakens in summer and strengthens in winter. The lower part of the polar vortex, the one we're concerned with, can sometimes break off and move south. When this happens, it can bring with it frigid temperatures that are unusual for regions accustomed to milder winters. As the polar vortex dips south, much of the United States and Canada will feel its icy grip. The Midwest and Northeast are likely to experience the most significant temperature drops, with some areas seeing temperatures plummet 20 to 30 degrees Fahrenheit below average. But even regions farther south won't be immune. The Southeast may experience brief periods of unusually cold weather, a stark contrast to its typically mild winters. Section 5, A Blanket of White Snowfall Predictions Along with the bitter cold, the southward plunge of the polar vortex is likely to bring significant snowfall to many parts of North America. The Great Lakes region, in particular, is expected to see heavy lake-effect snow, potentially leading to hazardous travel conditions. The Northeast and Mid-Atlantic regions are also likely to see their fair share of snow, with some areas potentially experiencing blizzard-like conditions. Even areas not accustomed to heavy snowfall such as the Southern Plains could see some accumulation. Section 6. Thermometer readings, plummet, anomalies explained. When we talk about temperature anomalies, we're referring to how much warmer or colder temperatures are compared to the average for a particular time of year. These deviations from the norm can be influenced by a variety of factors including atmospheric patterns, ocean currents, and even human activities. Understanding these anomalies is crucial for meteorologists and climate scientists as they provide insights into broader climate trends and help predict future weather patterns. In this case, the arrival of the polar vortex will bring negative temperature anomalies, meaning temperatures significantly lower than what we typically expect. The polar vortex is a large area of low pressure and cold air surrounding the Earth's poles. During winter, this vortex can expand, sending cold air southward with the jet stream, this results in sudden and severe drops in temperature affecting large regions and causing widespread disruptions. 
These anomalies can be quite dramatic, with some areas experiencing temperatures more typical of the Arctic than their usual winter climate. For instance, cities that usually have mild winters might find themselves dealing with snow and ice, leading to challenges in transportation, infrastructure, and daily life. The impact on local ecosystems can also be significant, as plants and animals struggle to cope with the unexpected cold. It's a stark reminder of the power of nature and the importance of being prepared for extreme weather events. Communities need to have plans in place to deal with such anomalies from ensuring that vulnerable populations are protected to maintaining essential services during severe weather. Emergency services play a critical role in responding to these events, providing aid and support to those affected. As we continue to study and understand these anomalies, we can better anticipate and mitigate their impacts, ensuring that we are more resilient in the face of nature's unpredictability. Section 7. Stay informed, stay safe, weather resources. In the face of such a potent weather event, knowledge is power. Stay informed about weather forecasts and warnings issued by your local meteorological agencies. The National Weather Service in the United States and Environment Canada are excellent resources for up-to-date information. Pay close attention to watches and warnings. A watch means conditions are favorable for severe weather, while a warning means severe weather is imminent or already occurring. Section 8. Winter's Embrace. Preparing for the cold. As the days grow shorter and the nights become longer, the chill in the air signals the arrival of winter. It's a season that brings both beauty and challenges, and being prepared can make all the difference. Now that you understand the science behind this impending cold snap, let's talk about how to prepare. Meteorologists have been tracking the weather patterns, and scientists have provided insights into what we can expect. This knowledge is crucial, but practical steps are equally important. Remember, a little preparation can go a long way in ensuring your safety and well-being. Start by assessing your home. Check for any areas where cold air might seep in. Simple actions like sealing windows and doors can significantly improve your home's warmth and energy efficiency. Winterize your home. Check your home's insulation, seal any drafts, and ensure your heating system is in good working order. A well-maintained heating system is essential. Schedule a professional inspection to make sure everything is functioning correctly. This can prevent unexpected breakdowns during the coldest days. Stock up on supplies. Gather essential items like non-perishable food, water, warm clothing, blankets, flashlights, and batteries. Think about what you might need if you were unable to leave your home for several days. Having a well-stocked pantry and emergency supplies can provide peace of mind. Prepare your vehicle. Have your car winterized, keep your gas tank full, and pack a winter survival kit. Winterizing your vehicle includes checking the antifreeze levels, ensuring your tires are suitable for snowy conditions, and having a reliable battery. A winter survival kit in your car should include items like a blanket, extra clothing, a flashlight, and some non-perishable snacks. Protect your pets. Bring pets indoors and ensure they have a warm place to stay. Pets are vulnerable to the cold, just like humans. Make sure they have a cozy spot inside, away from drafts. If you have outdoor animals, provide them with adequate shelter and extra bedding to keep them warm. Look out for others. Check on elderly neighbors and those who might need extra help. Winter can be particularly harsh for the elderly and those with limited mobility. A simple check-in can make a big difference. Offer to help with groceries, shoveling snow, or just providing some company. Have a plan. Create an emergency plan with your family. Know who to contact in case of an emergency and keep a list of important phone numbers handy. Stay informed by using weather apps and listening to local news updates. Being prepared means being proactive and ready for any situation. Embrace the season. While preparation is key, don't forget to enjoy the beauty and tranquility that winter brings. Spend time with loved ones, enjoy indoor activities and make the most of the cozy atmosphere. Winter can be a time of reflection and togetherness. So, take the opportunity to create warm memories. With the right preparation, you can face the cold with confidence and peace of mind. Winter's embrace can be both challenging and beautiful, and being ready ensures you can enjoy all that the season has to offer. Section 9. A final word. Respecting the power of nature. As we brace ourselves for the arrival of the polar vortex, let us remember that we are but temporary residents on this planet. Nature, in all its fury and beauty, is a force to be respected. By understanding these weather patterns and heeding the warnings of scientists and meteorologists, we can weather the storm so to speak, and emerge safely on the other side.